I'm diving into ML Flow, a powerful open source MLOps platform that takes you from experiment to deployment, no fluff. Stick with me and you'll see why it's a favorite for tracking, versioning, and serving both classic ML and cutting edge Gen AI models. ML Flow is built for data scientists, ML engineers, and AI teams who want total control, flowing from laptop to cloud without getting locked into a vendor. You pip install it, plug it into your code, and instantly log runs, metrics, artifacts, prompts, and model versions. The UI is clean, intuitive, and framework agnostic. Whether you're using TensorFlow, PyTorch, Scikit-Learn, Spark, or LOMs, what makes MLflow stand out? Its latest release, MLflow 3, supercharges Gen AI workflows. You get prompt registry plus optimization. Version your prompts like code, track token usage, and fine-tune them automatically. There's full trace logging. Capture every prompt, response, API call, latency, so you can debug live systems in production. The new logged model metadata links runs, traces, models, all in one view. You can even log human feedback and evaluation metrics if you're testing with real users. It's free, flexible, and cloud agnostic. Want Databricks? Use managed MLflow. Prefer your own infrastructure? Self-host with minimal overhead. It scales easily and plays nice across platforms. Trade-offs? The UI stays minimalist. If you want polished dashboards or RBAC out of the box, you'll need to layer on tools or pick a managed service. And yes, if you're after full DevOps automation or no-code pipelines, something like SageMaker or Vertex AI might feel more turnkey. Bottom line, if you care about transparency, version control, and building both traditional and Gen AI workflows that scale, MLflow delivers big, fast, free, and no lock-in.